Hey, it's Fibroha Michelle. I'm so sorry you haven't been around. I thank you guys for all your subscriptions. I'm honored, really. And I'm happy that the words I've said have helped you. You know, I always just do this with my computer, and then I never look back or correct anything, because I just wanted to be an honest expression of how I'm feeling. And my computer broke for a while, and as you guys know, as fibro people, lights hurt your eyes. It's difficult to drive. The only Mac store, you know, you have to park and, you know, it's tough to get to places unless you have someone to help you. So anyway, I didn't get my Mac fixed and I probably could have done it other ways, but my brain doesn't work like it used to. You know, I could do my bills in 20 minutes. Now it takes me four hours and still make mistakes and, you know, the thing is, is what we all have to realize. No one, we know our reality. We know we hurt. We know that there's some days, no matter how hard you try, it's hard to get out of the bed. But unless people have actually had some type of pain, they'll never get it because they have their own reality. They think everybody feels like they do, just like, we think people should understand us because we feel like we do. You know, so if everybody could stop judging people at the moment they meet them and realize there's a lot more behind it. I mean, I didn't tell anyone for years I was ill. I'd have a couple cocktails, go out and sing. That was my job. And be funny. Then I would go home and, of course, suffer and take me a couple days to recover and then get back up and do what I do. So as long as your appearance still maintains, you're going to be okay, they think. But they don't know the hell we go through with doctors believing us. That's why we need to start checking with each other when we go to doctors and that type of thing. Um, I better check this because I've never done what's on computer. Hold on. I'll probably come back.